how to make money online with a print-on-demand dropshipping business. Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you guys how you can make money with a print-on-demand dropshipping business. Now print-on-demand has become super popular and if you think that you can only do print-on-demand for your own products, well, you can actually create print-on-demand products with Shopify and sell them as well. And you can integrate a platform like Printify to do so. So without wasting any time, let's jump right in. Now to get started, simply head on over to Shopify and the first thing you're going to do is you are going to install the Printify application. Now you're going to click on settings on the bottom left and then click on apps and sales channels. Open up the Shopify app store and once you have opened up the Shopify app store, you're going to search for Printify. Now, once you search for Printify, you're going to install this application over here. Now, while our Printify application is installing, in a different tab, we can open up Printify.com in its full form. And then you can click on sign up on the top right and you can sign up with your email address and a suitable password. You can also sign in with your Google account if you want to use that. Now, going back into our installation process, I'm just going to click on install over here. And once we have done that, we have the Printify application installed. Now I can pin this on the left and it's time to log in to our Printify account. Simply select your account from here or input your account details. And once you proceed with your account details, your Shopify store will be connected. So just like that, our Shopify store has now been connected. And I can also choose to log in with the full version as well because it's the same thing. We have just done it in two different ways. So uh, this is our dashboard for our store and you guys will see your store and you can click on manage your stores to make sure that the correct store has been added. So to do that, I can just view the URL of my store. It's 8B2D48 and I can just view that. And this is the store that we have. So it is this one. Now to proceed with our print on demand products, I can go into catalog on the left on Printify and then I can view the products available in the wide directory of Printify. Printify has so many different types of products ranging from men's clothing to home and living items. You can pick out whatever thing you want to design. So let's say that I want to design a t-shirt, which is one of the most basic things out there. So you guys can see there are so many different types of variants of even a single t-shirt. And you might say, what is the difference between them? They're all just t-shirts. Well, First off, even if you think there is no difference between all of these, there are major differences and you will find that in the pricing as well as the number of sizes, color options, and print options available. So you sometimes have things like thermal printing, sometimes you have direct printing, sometimes you have other options as well. You will see quality markers as well as price ranges and shipping times will be variable for different suppliers because all these different listings just are displaying that the product is different. So these are normal t-shirts, but this is the v-neck t-shirt. This t-shirt might have, you know, different fitting sleeves. The sleeves on these are shorter. These are a bit longer. So you can pick out the one that you think looks the best and is the best value for your money. You can also make sure to optimize this with your target market. So for us, it's the United States. Now, once you've chosen your product, you can open the product up and then click on start designing. Once you click on start designing, you can begin adding your design on Printify. And I will click on on the left and I can click on upload and upload an image. So let's say I want to use this image over here. And this file is now being added to our library. And now the file will be loaded up and you will see on the right a resolution indicator. This resolution indicator will tell you how the quality of your product is going to look and if it shows you that oh the quality is not going to be good so if i expand my design like this you can see it's telling me it's going to be low resolution you want to make sure that you have high or good resolution whenever you are creating print on demand products because otherwise your product will have uh, a grainy effect 
Now, after that on the left, we also have options to add text, graphics, as well as import images from Shutterstock or Fiverr. We can even do AI generated images with Printify. On the right, you will be able to select your variants, so you can choose different colors to work on as well. Once completed, click on Save Product on the bottom right, and you can proceed with the next step, which is publishing your print-on-demand product on Shopify. So first off, you will have your title image and mock-up views that are inserted. Now, I want to use the first image, and then I'll use this one. I will also use this one, this one over here, like so. And once done, I can move towards the next section, which is the listing detail. Now, this is where you're going to uh, alter the listing detail because this is the way it is going to be displayed on Shopify. So to alter this, what I'm going to do is firstly, I'll add a more interesting title, which is going to be bracelet printed T. And then after that, we have our description, which I recommend you rephrase using an AI tool that can help you in just ensuring that everything looks cohesive and it doesn't look like you just copied and pasted this directly off of Printify. Add this information and just go into ChatGPT and then ask it to rephrase and rewrite. Rephrase and rewrite in a elegant way like this. And now ChatGPT will rephrase and rewrite all of this with a different tone. And you can pick out whatever tone that you prefer. Copy and paste this into your product description like so. And then after that, you have different tags you can add and the shipping method you want to use. Below that, you also have your pricing. So I want to add small, medium, and large as the sizes. And we can choose the pricing we want. So we can see our profit margins as well as our retail price. Let's say I want to sell this shirt for $30. So I can just set that up over here like this. Once done, we can go on ahead and click on publish on the bottom right. And now our print on demand product from Printify will directly be added to our Shopify store. So if I click on product over here, in a couple of seconds, our new product should be displayed as well in Shopify. It can take a couple of seconds for the product to be loaded up, so don't worry about that. But moving on, you can even order a sample for yourself to be able to see the product, how it feels, how it looks like in person. You can go into your My Product section to manage products over here. Currently, you guys can see the status says that it is currently being published. So I can wait a couple of seconds for our publishing to be completed. Now, another thing to note is that when you get orders with Shopify and print on demand and print on demand platforms, the orders will appear on Printify as well as Shopify. And if you enable automated fulfillment, you will see that your uh, products will be added to the, uh, your products will be fulfilled and sent to the customer, even if you don't approve transactions manually. Now you guys can see this is our product over here. These are all the nice little images that we used. And this is how you can create your own print on demand products using Printify and Shopify. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe.